going on guys? My name is Shane and if you can see in the background, I have Miss Ella with me today. Um, I needed to film this video and I wanted to do it first thing in the morning. Now my face looks really dirty. Now that's just because my tan is fading. I actually have to redo my tan today. But I wanted to do it understandably after today's video. So I have like really blotchiness, especially around my mouth. Like it almost looks really dark. So I ask if we can please forgive me for that. Um, but today I'm also filming with a new camera which I'm really excited about um, there'll be some videos coming out that have been pre-recorded that aren't using this camera I had to push this video out because it is a collaboration we will get into that in just a second so I had to push this video out first but I'm so excited that I got a, a, a camera for my birthday. Just know that, you know, there's a couple videos coming out that might not be in this quality and that's why, but we'll get back into this um, groove of using this camera pretty soon, I promise. But today, like I said, we do have a collaboration and I have some chocolate milk. I made Ella some chocolate milk and it looked really good. There's something about like ice cold milk in Oh, it's so good. Okay, let's get into today's video. So, the company who sent me the LED Project E Beauty Mask are back. But they're back today with another product. So, this company reached out to me again. Um, they wanted to do an another collaboration. And I saw this on their website. And I'm like, hmm. A couple of months ago, we reviewed something just like this. Which happens to be the Dermasuction. So, we tried something like this. Um, probably back, I don't know, sometime late last year, I believe. Now this is just like a Walmart as seen on TV. It worked decently. I actually still use it to this day. It is battery powered operated. But that's the thing. It's like I feel like there are stronger and more professional versions of this. And because I love this one so much, I think I want to find one maybe just a little bit stronger. But I brought this little guy up here today because I want to put it to the test once again and compare it to the new uh, vacuum and blackhead removal therapy but from Project E Beauty. And I just want to see which one is better. I want to compare the prices and stuff. So that's what today's video is about. I do have a hot cloth right here. Um, I actually, I'm going to bring it downstairs one more time, get a little bit hotter. Um, but this is what I'm going to use today to open up my pores. I think any device like this or any pore strip you use is going to work best right out of the shower or like right after if like you have a portable steamer or something, which I kind of want to get my hands on. Maybe in this video I'm going through Amazon right now to figure out the price of a handheld steamer because that is something that I would really look forward to maybe investing in. So I'm going to look into that. But I'll be right back. I'm going to wet this again. Allow it to open up my pores. We will open this up. So I will be right back. Okay, I'm going to open up the blackhead removal really quickly. Uh, <laughs> yes? I'm watching my movie. I know you're watching your movie. How do I open this? I feel like I had a hard time opening up the other package too. <laughs> but it opens from like the top or the bottom. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I have batteries or something for it. I didn't even think it might have to be charged. So it <laughs> might not even be prepared. But I will say automatically the packaging is better than this one. Um, I remember the derma suction coming in like it was a cardboard box again, but it came in like a pl plastic, like you pulled the pieces out of a plastic. Um, this one woo, comes in a styrofoam packaging. If you can see that, all the heads are coming out, the instructions, all that fun stuff. And I see a <laughs> USB charger. Crap! Okay, I'm going to try to get this charged for a couple minutes. That's the thing. It's like... I get, I, I'm not gonna knock it because it's a USB charger, but like I have so many devices with chargers and I don't know what goes through what anymore. And it's just like, sure, let's have another one. Right, that thing is now on a USB charger, at least for a couple minutes. I just needed to have a little juice, just a little juice for today's video. But just like my dermosuction, this did come with four different heads. I'm assuming for about the same purposes. It looks like we have this little flat oval one. This also came with a dermosuction. This is actually like my favorite one to use. It gets around like, the ridges of your nose really, really easily, like kind of those hard to reach places. The next tool, if I remember correctly, again, has some suction power. You can tell that this one is more of a circle than an oval. Um, so this one I kind of use, 
I tend to use like on these kinds of areas. Um, and then we have the exfoliating one, which again is just to exfoliate. So if you have like dry skin or dry areas, you can use this little tool to help exfoliate while you pull out dirt and oils. And then we have last but not least this larger one, which is much larger than the one that I got from Dermasuction. I also have another little um, project that we're gonna be trying pretty soon. And this is a heated eyelash curler. What? But this has a um, plug as well. So I'm gonna go and, <laughs> oh my God, why does everything come with plugs? I am gonna make sure that I plug in this one as well. So I guess I just need to look at my stuff beforehand. Um, but let me see, Project E Beauty also came with this little card. It says Project E Beauty in the front. Oh, and then it's just telling you how to leave a review if you want to. Oh, there is another difference. This one comes with this little baggie, this was stuck in the box, but this has five filters and two seal rings. So like this one, I didn't have to set up at all. Um, I'm assuming the other one I'm gonna have to set up maybe. For each treatment, you wanna do it for about two to three treat, you wanna do it for about two to three minutes and it says one or two treatments a week is recommended. Before you, first use of the advice, charge it at least two hours. Oh, for weak gentle suction. That's the one that I was talking about, the little circle one. So this is for, again, um, gentle, weak and gentle suction. It's used to remove blackhead at delicate areas. This is the medium round hip for strong and powerful suction. I'm so confused because it literally shows me. Was there one? Maybe this one's still attached because this is showing me five heads and I only have four, so I'm just getting confused. Let's try this again. It must have one on it. I'm gonna assume it's probably the medium suction tip. So weak and gentle is the small round one. The medium one that is probably on the device is for a stronger and powerful suction. The large round suction promotes blood circulation, speeds up muscle recovery, and the suction allows new blood to flow into the area of tissue to enhance circulation. I can't get the answer to that on Apple Watch. That's cool. The derma suction definitely didn't have that head. I I just thought those were like, <coughs> I don't know, a massive blackhead, I don't know. And then the oval suction tip is for skin lifting, pulling upwards to treat fine lines. It increases skin's elasticity and firmness. I just use it for like the crevices of my nose, I don't know. Um, and then the micro crystalline dead skin exfoliation tip. Um, I was right about that. It just lifts off dead skin. So it says you can disinfect the tips with 70% alcohol using a soft cloth. You don't wanna use a scrub cream or like an exfoliator while using this product. Oh, the cool thing is too, um, as I'm reading on, is the new one has a level of like suction. So you can up the ante of the suction. So it says the level one. So you just have to like repeatedly press the on button to get to different levels. The level one is the blue light, level two is the green light, and level three is the red light, which is the strongest suction. This one just had one. Well, actually, no, I lied. Technically has two because if you lift it a little, turns on, and then if you lift it more, has a higher suction. It doesn't sound like there is that much of a difference, but that does have two options. So um, this new one has three. The device will turn off after five minutes, and then you can replace your filter as needed. So that is cool. And again, that is not something that came with a derma suction. I'm assuming you would either have to look online somehow. And I think they're talking about like this little part um, inside so you can like lift that off. Oh, I see what they mean. Gross. So like you would pop out that little filter, put in a new one. Okay, cool. So very, very nice. Let me go see if that thing has at least a little bit of juice and uh, we'll see how it goes. And this thing is, it's, it's cold again. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> oh, excuse me. If this thing has any juice in it whatsoever, so I just took it off the USB port. We will go ahead, hit the light. Okay, so it's definitely sucking. There is the blue light, the green light, and then the red light. Can't really see the lights very well, but you can hear it. And then you just hit it again to turn it off. So. With that being said, this has a medium suction. To be fair, I'm going to compare it with the same head. 
that is on my derma section. So both of these are going to have the oval point. And I really just want to concentrate it around the nose because I feel like that's where I have the most buildup. So that's where I'm going to get the most fair comparison. So we're going to start on the medium section considering this has two settings. So I'm just going to... I've used this before, so not this one obviously, but I definitely have a feel for it. Okay, anything? Ooh! Whoa, we're seeing results right away. And that's only on like the medium setting. Okay, wow, I just want to save that battery a bit. Ooh, okay, let us go immediately into the derma suction. A little bit of a different noise, and we're going to do... This side. I mean, this one works, I know that, but I feel like... I don't know, I just feel like I got like a faster result with the Project E Beauty one. Both of them have picked up stuff. This one is definitely much, much prettier, and I didn't use it on its highest setting. So that's as high as the Dermasuction one went. I want to use this on its highest setting now. It's a little bit quieter, even on its highest. Oh, lordy. <laughs> so I don't even know if you guys are going to be able to like really even see in there, but it's there is definitely some stuff caught on like the rim there, um, but look, I think it's just much, much prettier than the derma suction. I'm going to hold up the derma suction here. Um, so you can tell that one is like rose gold, one is just like blue and silver. Aesthetically, I like this one better. I just think it looks prettier, um, but I also like that I had three different options. Now, I want to test out quickly, while I still have a little bit of battery, I want to try out one of the other heads, and I think I want to try the this large tip here. So we're going to put it on its highest again. Oh my god! Okay, we're going to put it on its... Ow! <laughs> we're going to put it on its lowest. Wow! That almost sucked my face off! That was like one of those face suckers from, what is it? Aliens vs. Predators, maybe? I swear! It's like... <laughs> like, like, what? You thirsty? What the heck? I didn't think it was gonna come off my face! Whoa! Ew! I feel like it's not... Ow! I feel like it's not as gross when it's your... Ah! <laughs> <laughs> this thing is so strong and I'm only on the first setting. <laughs> it's not like painful, but it's not. Like I wouldn't oh my God. sit there and be like, you know what I want to do right now? <laughs> but I think it's fun. You hear that squeak? I think it's fun. I think it's effective. Okay, let's try the medium suit. I'm scared. This thing. Okay. I just have a lot of blackheads like under the nose. Ah! Ah! Oh, my lip! Ow! Ow! Don't get your lip, y'all. Ow! Okay. I wasn't trying to get my lip. That just kind of caught. I'm working without a mirror. I'm working with a viewfinder. Oh my gosh. That made my nose run and everything. Okay. So that was a lot of fun. I don't think I have a lot of battery in here. So I have to get this back on the charger. But it works pretty much the same way my dermosuction one did. I definitely think it's much more powerful. I did not get that kind of suction with the dermosuction. This wanted to literally take my face with it. But I feel like you need that. I know that similar products like this are used used um, for skincare in professional settings so the idea is there for sure um, is the execution there I think so I like this one a lot better than a dermosuction one if you are looking for something with the price point of this one it works but you're not gonna get the same results I don't think if you maybe spend a little bit more and get this and I do have a discount code for you guys so if you're interested in it please feel free to use that discount code so anyways guys thank you so much for sitting down with me this this morning my face is like it it doesn't feel like anything except for my lip <laughs> because it's like it's just a little tiny bit sore because it was just you know 
ripped from my face. I really love this. I really, really recommend it. Project E Beauty is one of those companies that I collab with that if I tell them, hey, I want my opinion to be 100% honest, they are totally down. They've never given me a problem with that. I totally dropped the ball because I always like to put that disclaimer in the beginning of the video, letting you guys know that any collaboration that I do, whether it's today or in the future or in the past, I've always made sure that they are 100% honest and real. And I actually keep um, screenshots in my email. So if every, anyone ever came up to me and said, hey, like this company, uh, you sold out to this company. You you said everything that they wanted to tell you. That's not true. And I can pull up the email saying that all the opinions are my own. There are some features that I may like mention, but like at the end of the day, if I'm trying, if I'm telling you guys that the product is worth it, that's not the company doing that. That is me doing it. I just want you guys to know that this product is awesome, makes your kid crack up, and I am very grateful for, for Project E Beauty sending this over to me uh, to review today for you guys. So. With that being said, I love you guys so, so much. If you did enjoy today's video, please go ahead, show your support, leave your thumbs up on the video, and while you're down there, hit that subscribe button. If you want to leave a comment or have any questions about the product, um, I will leave all the links down in the description. But if you want to reach out to me personally, please feel free to reach out to me on my Instagram or my Facebook. Find the thumbnail of this video and leave your comment or question there, and I will get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you guys again so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!